Okay, yet another stinky rat bag for pie charts. We've got a, a pie chart where you're given the value of the number of children in each sector, and you've got to give those as percentages. A little bit harder than fractions, but if you knew, use your fraction and percentage knowledge, it shouldn't be too bad. Here's an example. Again, we'll talk something yummy to put us off the fact that it's a stinky rat bag. Let's talk favourite sweets. Jelly Babies, Millions, Smarties and Haribo. So here we've got a group of children who've been asked, what's your favourite type of sweet? OK, to work it out as a percentage, the first thing you need to do is you need to work out the total. Total number of children who were asked. So let's add those together. We've got 3, 30, 15 and 12. If we top those up, we've got 3, 5 and 2, which make 10, carry the 1, and the 10s column adds up to 60, so our total is 60. So first of all, let's work on millions. How many people like millions? Well, we've got 3 children, 3, and it's 3 out of 60. Now remember from when we did percentages that if we want to change a fraction into a percentage using that triangle of ours. The first thing we need to do is we need to make that into a fraction that is over 100. Now we can't do that straight away. So the first thing we do is we simplify. So if we simplify this, we will get, let's see, what can we divide by? We can divide by 3 and we get 1 over 20. So from here, we can change that into a fraction over 100 by timesing the top and the bottom by 5. So we get 5 over 100. As soon as you've got a fraction with 100 as the denominator, this becomes your percentage. We can say 5% of children like the millions. Let's move on to the Haribo. Let's go for the Haribo. We've got 12 over 60, 12 out of the 60. OK, again, I can't change that into 100 straight away by multiplying. So I'll simplify first of all. If I divide by 6, I can get 2 over 10. And then I can times that by 10 to give me 20 over 100. The top number becomes 20%. Sometimes there are sectors that are really easy to work out and you don't actually have to do complicated conversions like this. For example, if you look at the Jelly Babies, that is clearly one half of the pie chart, so one half would be 50%. Also, if you look at the Smarty section, that's clearly got a right angle in the corner. So we have got a quarter here, so one quarter would be 25%. Do actually be suspicious of the way that they draw them because sometimes they don't draw them totally to scale. I would be confident that's a quarter because also if you look, that's half of this section over here. 